basically networks no basically networks with uh, how computer networks uh, functions so the things not done is describing benefits and disadvantages of so the types of networks how communication hardware are I don't know, describe in a ano, ano ang ibang klase nila na hardware na nagamit ta sa subong and how what are the communications media na involved in doing this uh, network functions kama function sila pag mag uh, perform sila sa nila na ano ang, ang pulos ka nila sa ilang importance sa ton yung mga networks and the different topologies also will be describing those as well as the network architecture protocols and then a few vocabularies naman natin uh, base bar broadband, topology no bus, the client server network uh, communications channel data communications, ethernet and the local area network or the LAN and of course we have the these terms no peer to peer network, no modem also during topology, router, server uh, star topology, token ring Cloud transmission media and the wide area network. So by its basic definition, based on the first nato nga uh, topics about the internet, no, this a group of two or more computers linking together is also, is already considered as a network. And how this transmission is uh, of this data is being, uh, I don't know, performed from one location to another is what we call the as uh, or data communications. So the five components of this data communications are these uh, terms, the sending device, the signal conversion device, communication path, receiving, de uh, receiving device and communication software. So as these components are represented by, by actual peripheral devices, yun natin, na later on ni Pagita or Manundi, uh, each uh, step here is very important, you know, kag may may certain uh, device na you know, function for for its purpose na magiging sa sa mga nga mga step so we we'll build on the advantages or disadvantages of a network so start on is a post niya about uh, information sharing hardware sharing and software sharing as well as collaborative environment so important of sharing among um, pareho sa functions sa internet internet natin uh, information is uh, uh, shared throughout the the that kind of the wide, wide area network natin so ang benefit man natin is kung may kung may kinanad na information isa na natin kasearch natin mayara na nasa dayon yung mga boy and that is uh, because of this uh, wide area network natin yung, yung internet kung muna kung uh, makashare ng tasa natin information at uh, at instant kung uh, at any time gusto na to ni share and this advantage naman dira is agi dira yung ang vulnerabilities natin sa hack and malicious code so also with the same as phishing sites or uh, mga virus na makasulad sa ating network it will cause nga mag magkagubaan natin ulit the systems but also the the software that we use and equipment problems given na uh, uh, how big be or how large scale ang isang network na ginobla nyo ang investment on that hardware and software is also, is also considered kag ang mga nangyayon siya basta basta ang magasto ka lang given na mag set up ka sa isang ka large scale network so medyo magasto ang gagid in terms of the check, uh, checking the hardware and the software na gamitin mo and of course uh, as an effect uh, may dinan sa man sila is considered as another disadvantage so the two common types of networks that we have on the current are the local and the wide local area networks or LAN and the wide area networks or the WANs. And we also other have uh, other types of these networks, the specific uh, specialty to separate the search engines uh, These are metropolitan area networks no, or the MANs, the personal area networks, MAPANs, uh, home area, uh, HANS and Campus area networks and the kinds like the parehas atin sa San Agustin so most area networks the local area networks connect to personal computers and devices in a limited geographical area okay sa term pa lang ang local ito local local area uh, limited lang siya within a certain block or a certain building or maybe even a certain laboratory lang dara na sila connect 
in each of these devices the curriculum network is called the uh, anode and they tend to share resources for use of internet and programs and other hardware as for, uh, as for the wireless lan naman naman na lang yan lang differences of course the term lang wireless wala sa some physical wires na involved to connect to that network they just use uh, 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 signals or bluetooth or any other na wireless na communication to to be able to connect so in this uh, example no, how your client server or uh, local area network uh, is, uh, is set up in the ilang connection uh, flow niya coming from first of the internet no? so once mo connect sa internet kinala mo gano'n initially ang, ang modem mo and the router or medyo mix, mix naman yung susubong sa current yung mga version sa modem na ito um, when you go to the server and the server is the center computer of your network no? it can be nawala na siya itong display but it has its own hardware and software to to be able to communicate to each of those nodes then as the information goes through the server it, it met uh, a firewall to filter out the unwanted no? example mga phishing possible mga malware or hack na sites na masulod so it will block those uh, links or uh, any other data nga masulod ito to your firewall and then it will, it will now go to your uh, switch or hub so this hub then will then divide this uh, uh, data and send sa mga server into each of these uh, specific computers so basically this is your what it uh, will make your client uh, no, or nodes in the computer na makakonek sa inyong server so it's, it's uh, sa, yes sa peer to peer dan sir ha for example sa peer, mag ano ka peer to peer bala as a peer to peer uh, direct lang na uh, direct lang no oh. karan may topic talaga about that so amo ni amo ni sa net ano uh, no sa client server ni set na setup um uh, Tikaw nga mo tong isa no. So, yung isa ka computer siya may local printer siya. So, ang local printer yan eh. Pabili, pwede yun yung mga sa ibang. Pero, isa lang setup. Ang sini is uh, siya lang. Ang amunan niya yung computer. Magagamit si computer N. Then, si computer 1 from starting. Siya, siya yung first na connecting sa dire sa hub. Though, wala man nagamatter. Kung di hindi ng ano, numbering yan. Pero, these are even, evenly ano, connected naman sa ito yung switch. Or sa hub. And, amunan naman na it depends on pila capacity isang hub say kung pila lang ka computers or devices ang kaya ya connect tapos the rest ya ti makonect man sa iba nyo eh, sa mga sub sa mga wifi sa mga computers or, or for example video rin lang sila makonect or may ila outside ito nga laptop i-connect o connect mo lang sa kay, sa kay computer one pwede man na but not diri kung once nga mapuno na niya ng hub uh, usually i-cover yan wala nang and uh, use nito nang nodes na available and so sa laptop pwede mo sa mga wires dili or cable also with the network computer no ah, i mean network printer uh, we we can have it as a cable connection or wireless man the same man kung tan tanan ko na command niya dili sa from your server can be distributed so kung isang mag send siya dili sa next no as you computer one we mapa print sa network printer it, he can access this uh, printer through this uh, no, sa switch sa hub so, you will just uh, locate na no, magita niya man na may network, uh, example may network tab no, that's sa, ano, sa my computer, yun, may ara na Tapos, magita niya na mga available ng devices na commonly shared, usually the, ano, sa makita ng inyong uh, network printer. And then, pili na sa dayon ka send given with the proper no, na authorities na pili sa kagamit. As send na dayon, kag, ano, na, pili na siya ka pa print or any other na output na gusto niya. So going to what the wide naman no, the largest one one wide other network is the internet. By its uh, definition, yelling it covers a large geographical area. So it is can also be composed of two or more LANs connected by routers. So once magduwa na kalan nga connection lang can be considered as a wide area na. The variations yung lang aling one is or can they also become intranet or extranet? Kung dunuman nyo sa una, itong internet is within na gano, within sa use of an organization. The same man sa extranet, sa sagwa naman siya yan. Uh, variations of one naman yung under pagkakayapon sa variations ng one nga, ano, nga kind of network. 
So, uh, ang aring naman din ba, ng definitions na makakano ba sa, sa Metropolitan to another, itong Regina, ang ginmention ta. Uh, the Metropolitan Area Network, a bigger na sa salan, but smaller sa one. So, ginaminsan na is, in a, mag, maghambaga ta Metropolitan, can be a city or can be a district. So, mas bigger ang ya geographical area sa typical nga local area network. But it cannot be bigger than the one. Usually, one at least among the mga internet natin or within the dakong large scale na kind of networks. Hindi ilagid na mano makabers ang yung mga metropolitan area network. As well as as a personal naman ang personal area network naman within the range ng thirty feet. Ah, usually, among the mga balay nyo ni or within sa block nyo or sa computer lab nyo naman na ng definition sa yung mga personal area network or your plan. The same with home area network, within a user zone, mo muna yung uh, uh, definite nga definition. Kung sa campus naman is collection of the lands sa uh, university campus natin. So, mo na itong kagina, peer-to-peer na uh, these are network architectures natin. Uh, for most lands na ginagamit, ang mga first nga i-discuss nga kagina ng client server, then the peer-to-peer -peer na uh, network architecture. So, when we describe again the client server network no? may one or two computers that acts as a server and then may nos sila mga network operating systems natin may software to handle the no? the data transfer and communication within these uh, clients no? mga uh, computers na connected to that network so they also have software applications na nakastored na sa, naman siya dayon sa server kaya kung ano itong kakonek siya ang muna ng mga clients natin and these uh, clients computers are being uh, also added the uh, instructions and communications by by reserve adela uh, may may solid okay okay tapos peer to peer na tong kinina ng uh, computer equal mga basa nga peer to peer kun they will connect directly to each other over the internet so kung internet peer to peer naman ang usual na to nya nya scenario ang gwa yan na is yung na access niya na directly ang uh, isa ka computer without going through the server. Pero given magaling nga sa, sa wide area ng mga setup, may mga protocols man kita nga doon gina-implement para nga maka-ambo na siya na access nga, direct access na imbes nga mag na sa server. Kaya sila lang kumagi sa, 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 sa server, may mga ano pa siya. May mga amon ng protocol pa siya na pa na siya nga gyan, but within the server naman nga ano, kung ano naman itong setup sa server, itong mo um, naman ito dapat i-comply niya or i-allow siya sa server niya mga sulad sa mga itong network. Okay, so, communication devices na ito, that is what uh, are ang um, mga important na ito yung network hardware yung kinanglan na ito uh, para maka-establish kita sa isa ka-network, either LAN or wire, wide area network na ito. So, communication devices facilitate in transmitting and receiving data. Ang kong magiging natin is ang mga mga modem natin. Okay, through the internet, we need a modem to communicate using the the ano, the, the uh, uh, allocated na protocol. So, we have this uh, type of no? modem. We go with the the, uh, the first given step ng dial up. So, kung mga baga ng dial up, ang data transmission are using analog telephone lines. Ang yan ang problem, when you use dial-up naman, ang inyong telepono, hindi nyo na magamit. Basically, wala na na siya ba, ano? Kaya gin cover yan itong data transmission sa telephone line through your modem. Ang yan naman na drawback naman sa modem, kung kaso nga, isaka, alam mo ba yung ano, no, ang ano sa telephone, ano ba kung mantawag ka mo, kaya ma-disconnect naman na si si dial-up nyo. So, mo na lang pinaka-basic yun natin pag-start sa internet kung medyo mo na nagamit yun natin. But later on, nag-update naman sila using the DSL ng ano, no? So, digital subscriber line or what they call the integrated services digital network, the SDN. It allowed the digital transmission over telephone copper wires naman. So, in this method naman, mas, mas dasig, mas, uh, mas less uh, interruptions, mas ano pa siya mas uh, ang capacity mas, uh, mas taas na so using cable modem or shell cables naman to send and receive data 
may wireless modem naman tong version so para yung na sa aton sa mga cellphone so no we connect our wireless modem to para yung maka kuha mata di uh, sa aton nga <coughs> nga connection to the internet by using our wireless modem and we use interface uh, network interface card amo nang subong nga built in nga gid subong uh, sa mga bag-o nga computers naton pero before mayra na silang ginagamit nga ano nga network interface card which also acts as a device slot to blang pa dito sa mga board last time la inubutan nga dito sa ano no uh, expansion slots then ang network interface card could also function as like like those na card na ginabutan niyo sa inyong expansion slots but for modern versions of our computers we already have uh, built in na ano in IC na lang so basta di pag uh, pag install niyo na sa inyong computer after niyo assemble you can just uh, plug and play the cable of your direct thing to your modem para mag uh, dito na lang sila mag ano mag connect and for the gateway naman so for in hardware like in two different types of networks with different protocols so ang gawa yan sa gateway is it will provide um, convert yung ano kung ano itong protocol sa PIAC it will convert it as uh, kung mag-transfer sa data convert it sa common language na, ma, na maka-transfer sa other na network and then pag about naman sa PIAC it will convert naman siya sa sa, sa data communication nga using the protocol nga ginamit sa mga network so given a router no uh morning sample natin sa router may kita mo na may doon ang sila ka no kado tower sa kilid ni eh these are for the wireless na version no? but ang sa likod din sini may ano man siya may ports man siya for the RG45 niya para maka-connect ka mo uh, to your computer nga NIC man or kung ano sa mga sa laptop mo may uh, uh, cable port no? uh, I mean ko network port niya pwede sila makonect dire so it will direct network traffic na siya na yun yung manage ng aton nga connections in and out or you can authorize uh, several computers or devices to be able for them to connect or or limit nyo ng inilang uh, speed for the connection so for wireless access point no it will connect wireless communication devices together quite a wireless network then ang hub ang mga ng convergence natin where data arrives from one or more direction kaya ginawa siya ma-forward the one the yun sa other direction with also one or more nga ano na data nga gaabot so a communication channel ang mga itong link uh, this link that allows data to be transferred from one computer to another and then we describe the capacity of uh, communication channel as the bandwidth so, so mahabal na nga the greater bandwidth mas dasig ang mas damo ang data ang matransfer ta from one computer to another so given mo test nyo man yung, yung mga speed no? so bandwidth speed mo mahabal ang mga amun amun na may kita mo na ng bandwidth speed na uh, example be um, 1 MB per second so the capacity of that uh, ano transmission you will get uh, uh, you will know na ang amun na nga speed is 1 MB of 1 megabyte of data is can be transferred within a second or one yan. Pero kun la ay mas kaya din medi pareho sa mga high high bandwidth ng media natin pareho ni sa fiber na connection so um, fiber do abot ni sa this L so bang so given yan ang kaya nil ni, ni, ni fiber mag ano mag 30 MB or ano pa nang MB na speed according depende mag ni sa setup nila sa area. Mas maka Haboy pag yun sa isang higher net transmission na uh, no, data sa so, yung communication channel. So these are broadband connections. Kung standard naman nga uh, telephone lines, they call those as uh, baseband. So sa so one end, may sending device. May modem naman sa other. Ang modem, ang muna na siya ang makonvert sa signal to a form that will transmit over a standard dial up. Ang muna or anong, ano nga line yung depending sa setup. So kung sa ano naman, kung sa mga DSL naman, amo man ang function sa mga modem. Pinafollow niya lang kung ano ang protocol ng ihaboy niya. Ang communications, di, siya na lang doon yung bala, makonvert sa mga signal para maka-go through to that uh, broadband link or sa mga cable. So kung may switch naman, nakaitid sa telephone, establish a link between a sender and a receiver, tapos ang sa receiving end, may sama naman ito kong modem that will convert those signal back to its format wherein the receiving device can also understand 
So sending this data through channel requires this uh, type of uh, transmission, no? two types mga yapon, or physical or wireless. The same ito ko yun na defined sa broadband na to, no? may wireless, may broadband, may physical, may broadband. So when we describe a physical uh, media type of uh, no, 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 cables na to, no? we have this uh, three. Uh, sa telephone system sa nato, naman yung twisted pair ng table ang ginagamit. So, the, the two wires carries, the one carries the signal, the other absorbs the uh, signal interference. Then, it's uh, sa coaxial naman, for cable television uh, usage, the heavily shielded cable less than sa, sa interference than, rather than the typical na ginagamit natin sa telephone wires. Kag, um, na, ang fiber optic naman, naman yung external fiber, yung thin flexible glass tubing siya, they have higher capacity of uh, bandwidth to transmit uh, rather than uh, those metal wires tapos mas less susceptible to interference ni siya so for wireless signal ang manining uh, setup microwave signals are sent in form of electromagnetic waves and straight lines between microwave stations so we use satellite for lin halin sa air station no? it will throw ihaboy ang data sa satellite tapos ang satellite na fixed naman it will fix or orbit na siya na rin ang ma point naman sa isa ka other position naman sa earth sur sa earth sur surface and then the corresponding earth station nga ara dito ang mga naman ito siya masalo ay ma-receive sa mga mga data so they are placed in orbit and maintain a constant pos uh, position above one point on the earth sur surface so another transmission we will, uh, when we call the infrared na the IRDA media it sends signals using infrared light waves though mas uh, Not sure na ako sa kung may amo po sa media na type of transmission na ginagamit natin. So, lately, do, wala na po uh, kita nga doon na commercialize yung uh, mga setups nyo. So, describing Bluetooth, no? amo po naman mga Wi-Fi and the WAP. Ang Bluetooth naman niya, uh, within 30 feet naman na nang niya radio waves. So, they use it for data transfer na ito, no? kaya sa mga mobile device between mga PDAs, notebook, computers. But just uh, within the 30 feet na lang of uh, distance. So for Wi-Fi naman or the wireless fidelity, identifies any network based on the 802.11 family standards of the uh, no, so wireless transmission in the standard natin. So ang wireless application protocol, uh, ang morning, you know, cast the term protocol, no? how the user access information instantly through mobile devices or smartphones and pagers. So, these are the set of rules na ginabasiya natin para magpakatransmit sa data and information through this uh, communication uh, channels. So, going through the network configuration, we need to have uh, a topologies as to how these uh, uh, set networks are set up. No? Ang configuration natin dito. So, we start with the bus topology. Ang bus topology naman, may master cable sila which they call as the bus no, or the backbone the, all devices are connected to this backbone and there's no single host computer and uh, transmission sa data niya is uh, both uh, both directions so back and forth lang for assuring typology naman may circle nga uh, nga set up ang network though it goes in a circle tapos ang data travels from device to device naman around the ring they cannot travel from within but Amo na nang tawag natin yung star, star topology naman. They are connected to a central hub or computer. And then the form nito star gives a tulokon kay ang central hub, amo na yung stunga. Then the data that transfers from one computer to another must pass through that hub. So the surrounding niya nga, ano, no, mga end users niya, mga uh, nodes niya are located at the, at the edge. Tapos may center na na natin niya sa little hub wherein it will uh, manage the transfer of the uh, information from one from one of these computers to another so hence the gonna form young star so defining again the protocol and the set of uh, rules at the tires agree the plan procedures for transmitting uh, data between two or more devices so within work uh, work networking in lands the two widely used not only protocol are ethernet and the uh, token link So when we describe Ethernet based on bus topology na ito, no? ang magiging yan na uh, uh, base uh, configuration but uh, works also with the uh, start topology. 
Whereas sa token ring naman, uh, arranged na sila sa circle, so ang token ring can be considered as the, uh, ang iya configuration is based on circle topology. I mean, the ring topology. Where in the computer are arranged in a circle or in the token, a special signal is to, uh, used to travel around the ring. And amon ang iya nga protocol to communicate between this computer. Uh, between the computers nga ara sa sulod sa ring and so the internet naman ang major protocol natin is the TCP IP the transmission control protocol and internet protocol ang um, ning main gi natin ano so kung ma-configure nyo big example sa connection sa ano sa network na nan kung ma-connect sa internet mayra na dang tab na dang may TCP IP nga ano na option Either pwede mo na sabutangan sa specific na IP address or you let the computer na lang find the, the IP address tapos para mo na sa ganyan dito mo pag-connect. So all networks including network servers kinanagin na yung system. So as balik naman tapos sa definitions ng OS, hindi ka hulag ang term hardware kung wala ka sa operating systems na makontrol sa operation halin sa application ng software as up to the at all hardware so the network operating systems provide features among in file administration file management among printing of course and communication and security within the network so the two types of uh, OS nga ginagamit natin for working ang desktop OS natin pari naman sa Windows natin or sa Mac and a specific network operating system Usually, some network op operating system may built in sa lang networking fu uh, functions for the desktop. No? And kung sa, sa NOS naman, uh, usually, yung interface na is not na ganyan din sila uh, ano, GUI yung ilang setup. Either may alam mo silang uh, ano lang, uh, command prompt lang gamitin mo para mag-command ka sa computer for their, no, for their connection kung ano pa lang uh, <laughs> task nga po para mo sa, ano, sa within the network. So, to summarize, uh, communication is the no, data communication transmission data given network group of two computers linked together and the internet is the biggest network. No? It's considered as the largest one. Largest one again. So, so far, why not get the on that? And networks have disadvantages and advantages. And for the local network, you're confined to a limited geographical area, whereas a wide area network, you know, several LAN. So, two types of LANs, client server network, peer to peer network, and other size among the mga months, personal area networks, the home area and campus area. So, you can use a network for sharing information as well as uh, hardware sharing software, collaborative environment, and then linking between this data is transmitted through a communication standard. The transmission of this is either physical or wireless, then, kung sa physical among the mga cables natin, for wireless naman, the ano naman itong gamit sa modem or any wifi ng mga hub or mga devices na itong para makakommunicate so most network consists of the server and the computer clients then the facilities for receiving data instructions and information of all your uh, communications devices so it includes uh, the app cable modems ang mga rin this LNSDN also, those your NICs, your gateway routers, the wireless access points and hubs included in this list. So the NIC or the network interface cards can enable your PC to send and receive data between PCs. So router directs the traffic, network traffic, and wireless and are the Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, microwaves, satellites. Topologies includes three, bus, ring, and star. Then the set of rules, uh, procedures for transmitting data between two or more, de or more devices is called your protocol. And then the protocol is one of the most po popular LAN and probably the standard uh, protocol in certain mga LAN. Also, token ring is uh, secondly widely used and still considered as uh, another standard. TCP/IP for the internet used by both no LAN, and they need OS get all of your computers need an OS and network and NOS network operating system and you are able to the network to function along and with the computers connected so yeah so that's our app for this uh, uh, lesson 7 no?
any uh, questions or comments? Important, alam mo.